My name is Louise and I'm a Visitor Engagement Assistant at Tate Liverpool. When you come into the Dark Waters exhibition, obviously you, um, you're going to encounter three sound works by Lamin Furfana. And then on the walls you've got the 40 works by Turner and you go through areas of sunrises, sunsets, snowstorms, sea monsters, all the different conditions at sea that he was so powerful at capturing. Basically it's the power of the sea and it's a sound immersive experience which Lamin's created with his three tracks and then we've got the, the visual artworks by Turner that um, kind of are seen in a new way because they've been put with the sound artist. You need to come and see this exhibition because even if you're familiar with Turner's work, seeing it here, needing to fight through the elements of, for example, today's weather, looking at the river to get here, it kind of adds to the experience. And then the immersive sound that Lamin Furfan has created makes you see Turner hopefully in a, you know, in a new context. We're really excited for the Turner Prize um, launching here in Liverpool in October. Turner Prize was established in 1984. Turner was born nearly 250 years ago. In his legacy, he wanted to kind of support young and up and coming artists, which I think is how the prize came to be. If you go to takeliverpool.com, you'll be able to find out a lot more about the Dark Waters exhibition. <laughs>